hello and welcome back everyone um, as you can see oh that didn't go so well um, yeah the graphics are slightly different because I've changed my monitors so I can now get full um, resolution um, I've left it at a high graphics for the time being just to see how we go over the next couple of episodes because some of the textures they go a little bit further down um, in quality than I'd like to uh, so I'm just gonna see how we go with it um, even though the frames per second is is not good I'm hoping that it'll be reasonable still for you guys so you can see we've got uh, our nicely um, plowed field we've parked up the tractor up here so um, we don't seem to have the issue with the attachments um, that we previously had on agricultural simulator historical farming and um, so we'll just uh, disconnect that one now and we're probably gonna need to buy a cultivator because that's that's the next step isn't it so um, I'm sure it was cultivate then um, then it was um, fertilize then it was seed I'm sure that's what it told me I should, yeah, we'll figure it out. Um, I haven't actually done much about the admin screen, um, so not sure if we're... No, we're now unlocked, so it's allowing me... Not that it actually shows me anywhere different, because I have kind of had a look around on a, another save game, and you just don't find anything different, so um, I will off-screen take the Massey away. Well. Actually no, I'll leave you guys to vote um, in kind of, not this episode, but the episode, not next episode, but the episode after that, whether or not I kind of take the Massey and sell it, or if we leave it there as a bit of a kind of tribute to historical farming, um, up to you guys. So I'm not going to worry about it. What I am going to worry about is pressing the right button to go to the shop which is that one. Oh, oh goodness gracious me. Uh, so we want an extension. Oh, we talked about cultivating and... No, we don't want to cultivate and seed at the same time. That's just... yeah. That might be a bit overkill. That might be... So the working width of that is three meters. That's four meters. Um, this one's four meters. That one's six meters, and that one actually folds out. So that's pretty cool. Um, yeah, these ones are just getting on for crazy. Um, yeah, I'm not working with three meters worth. Mm, I might work with four meters worth. Um, yeah, let's start off with one of those. It's only eight and a half grand. We've we have got the money, but I don't want. I'm going to be. I'm going to continue to be uh, frugal. I said tight last week or last time, but um, I'm going to be frugal. We're getting the same achievement again. What's going on? So we now need to go and pick that um, piece of equipment up. Okay. So we're a little bit close there because of the roof. And you'll probably notice, I think I managed to kind of get the music for some reason all the way down uh, before. Uh, simply put, I don't know quite why. It's It seems that whenever I change the settings on the game, if I don't actually exit the game successfully, i.e. it doesn't crash, and it's been doing a fair amount of that, then it loses all the settings and reverts back, which is probably a good thing, just in case the settings are part of the cause. So, not knocking that. Um, I'm also pretty pleased with the autosave feature, which I think has kind of... I think that's a good bacon saving um, thing for UIG. Where's the... 
What does this do for a thingy? For the tractor? Oh, it's... I've clicked the tractor when it's that one that I need to click. Okay. Um... What are you doing? So let's get in, let's get that fold. That doesn't seem to be folded up. So let's um, up the hydraulics. Ah, oh, well done. That'll do. So again, ooh. What are you doing? You're behaving very strangely. Let's disconnect that thing and try again. Hmm? Because that doesn't make a lot of sense at the moment. Okay, so... You. Connect to you. Yes? Thank you very much. And now... I don't want you down in the in the working position. Let's just try driving on and see if it... it thinks that's normal. I don't, um, but hey, if it's happy... Oh, trees! Let's not um, challenge it f too heavily for now. So, there we go. So it's a beautiful sunny day. Still not getting a lot of responsiveness from the steering. So, there we go. We shall see. So let's um, stick that on. And away we go. Um, just to say, Toby, I have seen your comment about making sure that uh, we're using all the land. And we will. We'll we'll make some more fields um, but I just want to try and leave this manageable for the time being so that we can uh, do the job so there we go oh fold there we go so let's see how this works out let's go at speed 2 oh it's working quite nicely Now you can see, it looks like the grass at the side of it is being cultivated, but if we haven't ploughed the area, um, my experience in Ag Sim Historical was that you'd get a very, very low crop yield, and it just, it almost, it, well, it did mean that you weren't getting back what you put into the ground, and so that was pretty, pretty poor, but then again, that's pretty fair. If you don't do the full process, then... Uh, you shouldn't expect the results really. So there we go. So let's see if we can lift this up in a second rather than have to fold it. Yep, that works. So, uh, yeah, so we should be uh, pretty good to go. Do, do. So that should put it down. It hasn't really animated much, but... No. Yeah. Is it doing it? Yeah, it's doing it. So that'll do. But yes, yeah, so um, like I said, hopefully sound and graphics will be a little bit better. I have been doing um, a bit of work on that front. I've bought some new, uh, well, new televisions to act as monitors. I had an old TV, and it just couldn't handle the resolution. So um, I'm now getting what I hope will be full 1080p out of my games, and. Um, yeah, the sound-wise, I found that I, I'd i made an assumption about some of the settings on the sound, that they should be a particular way, and um, I wasn't necessarily right. So, um, 
So we're taking taking that into account, and hopefully um, from now on there won't won't be. I don't know if you all of you noticed that buzzing noise that was um, on the microphone. Um, it was bugging the heck out of me, and no one has actually really kind of complained about it, but um, I'd noticed it and it was bothering me. So um, hopefully. If it was bothering you, it's now gone, or at least significantly reduced. And I've um, seen a comment recently that um, the intro music is pretty kind of overpowering, so I'm uh, on the new videos I'm putting up that I hadn't already rendered, I'm uh, sorting that out too. So, like I say, I hope you guys uh, are enjoying. Uh, another good a bit of good news for all you AgSim fans. Um, you may, if you watch the Feed the Beast uh, with Das, you may have noticed that uh, we have had a slight change in schedule. So we're doing one a week um, for the next kind of month or so, uh, which means we've got a slot, a day open um, that we're going to get some more AgSim. So you have an AgSim in the interim period on a Monday and a Saturday. And um, then when we get back to doing our normal schedule, it'll move, and it'll be Tuesday and Saturday. So there is a plan. You will be getting two episodes a week, um, as long as the system holds up and doesn't kind of cause me great anguish. Um, but so far, so good. We've had a few issues. Um, no offence, that's what you expect from a UIG game. Um, and... In all fairness, nothing that is not easily overcome. And like I said, we, I think we found with Axiom Historical there was just sometimes a little bit of extra work required uh, just to recover a few things every once in a while. Like I said, the saving grace here with Agricultural Simulator 2013 is they have got the auto save feature. Um, and I think that is probably going to be very useful. But we'll keep our fingers crossed on that one. So, as you can see, this is uh, particularly thrilling going up and down a field. Um, I have experimented with hired workers in a test game, and I will be doing that. But this first first harvest, first crop, we're going to go through. We're going to do it ourselves, just to kind of, just basically to show that we can. And also to when when we've got workers that we need to boss around, if you've already done the job, it's a lot easier to tell them, how, well, tell them about doing it and make sure that they can do it properly. Otherwise, uh, how do how do your workers respect you if you don't if you're not prepared to put the graft in yourself? I think that's a little bit um, a little bit off, personally. So there we go. So yeah, um, there we go. So I think that's all the news for the minute. Um, if I think of anything else during the course of uh, the episode, I will let you know. But uh, yeah, no, I'm I'm really excited about the new kind of graphical setup and hopefully getting the sound settings sorted. Because like I say, uh, bugging me for quite some time. Um, <laughs> I'm a perfectionist and. I really do like to try and do things the best that I can. Sometimes that's not the best that somebody else can do, but it's as long as it's the best that I can do, then that's good for me. So I do appreciate you guys commenting uh, with suggestions on the episodes. They are always welcome. If it takes me a little time, I do record in advance. So if I haven't gotten to your comment in the very next episode, please don't be offended. Just bear with me. And um, also, if I don't get to it at all, then it could be that I've tried it off-screen and um, it just didn't work for me. So um, feel free to private message me if you if you think I'm ignoring you. I'm not. Um, I don't ever intentionally ignore any of you. Well, only when things are getting a little bit unreasonable, but you guys are pretty good for that. Um, so there we go. But yes, so um, auto save. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> That's why we had a little slowdown there. 
So hopefully this is going to make our soil nice and well, much nicer and leveler. So keep us out of mischief when we get these um, the combines and whatnot going over it. So so there. Hmm. So again, like I say, what you'll probably find is two episodes a week, so they'll be recorded pretty much together. Um, I do want to try and get myself in advance a little bit so that um, I've got stuff up and ready for you. Um, I'm heading off this weekend, so you'll see this on Saturday, and I'll be I'll be playing Uncle Fadman hopefully with my niece and. Uh, enjoying that immensely seeing my parents and yeah it's it's all good my mum's threatening to start watching the channel so um, I'll be in trouble soon and be kinda fad man why the heck did you say that and um, yeah so uh, that will be interesting I can't I can't really imagine if if um, my mum does subscribe and starts watching and she be kind of, oh why, why didn't you do that in that game and uh, yeah that's gonna be that's gonna be scary but um, but good it, it's nice that she's showing an interest and uh, supporting me in what I'm doing so you, you gotta love your mum and dad so well you don't have to but I I do love mine they're great they uh, they support me in in every way that's uh, important to support uh, sons or daughters, as it were. And yeah, what more could you ask for? Well, lots of money, obviously, but hey, if they don't have it, if they if they'd got it, they'd give it to me. So, or at least some of it. <laughs> so there we go. Da, da, da. Oh. So no no reversing beeps that we've had in previous um, incarnations of the normal agricultural simulator, but we have got the uh, the reversing lights and they weren't working in uh, one of the previous versions of one of the previous patch releases. They weren't working. So I don't know uh, if they're planning another patch release or not. Um, I'll keep an eye out if I see one then. I'll uh, I'll give it a go and uh, let you guys know obviously in the episodes I record after it. So should we go in? Should we see if we can go in cab for a minute? Let's let's try and make this a little bit different. See how we do. Yeah, that's doing all right. <laughs> Oh, we're definitely bouncing up and down on this, aren't we? Jeez! Bomb, 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 bomb. So where do we want to get to? For well, that should do it. If that works out that well, I should be pretty pleased. Um, obviously the uh, tractor sounds have gotten a little bit heavier. I don't know if that's going to start. Uh, overpower my voice. I hope not. But it's um, overpowering my eardrums, that's for sure. Okay, so let's get this going. Okay, that looks about right, so let's pop that down. And then, away we go! <laughs> bumpy, bumpy, bumpy. It's a bumpy old road, this. <laughs> so, just trying to mix it up a little bit so this isn't... Uh, it's, it's me going up and down the field, so there's only so much interest you can get from it. But, um... Different viewpoints help, I think. So, uh, oh, autosave. <laughs> I was just about to say it and then it popped up on the screen. So, uh, yeah. 
So yeah, so um, how many of you guys are actually playing the game, or are you guys kind of biding your time, waiting to see um, how things go and and if it's stable and stuff? So uh, feel free to comment. Um, I think everyone's probably interested in in how it goes, or at least I hope you are. Otherwise, why are you watching? Um, but yeah, I think. Stability issues aside, well, for the time being, I do like the game. I really do want to play it, so... I debated whether or not at some point to do a, a kind of a retro throwback to Axim 2012. Um, so, I haven't made my mind up on that. Ooh, come on, yep, get out of that rut. I'm guessing it's that rut that's behind us now. Um, okay. Come on, get that down. Let's go. Doom, 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 do, 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 doom. So. So this is um, pretty good going. Da, 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 da. I'm just enjoying the music. You see, the music keeps me company when I'm just doing this... when I have to do the stuff off-screen because it takes too long. Um, the music will keep me company. So, uh, hopefully it's not too annoying for you guys. If it is, let me know. I can I can turn it off. It's not something that has to be there. Um, I just find, if I do go quiet for a few seconds here and there, that um, if there's the music, then it's... It's not quite so boring. Um, I don't want that to be an excuse. Ooh, there we go. But, um, yeah. That's what have we got? Oh, we can see our seat. Oh, my goodness. We've got controls galore. Not on this side, we don't, but... There we go. Do, 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 do. But at least we can move around a bit faster in this one. So. Do, do, do. Okay. That'll do, I think. There, there we go. Bing. There we go. Go for it. So. Yeah. Bouncy, bouncy. So, we're getting that genuine kind of we're in a tractor bouncing up and down on the mud feel. So. I think um, that is something that you... you genuinely don't really see very much with farming sim and I know there's a whole bunch of you that are kind of firmly camped in the either the farming simulator camp or the agricultural simulator camp I'm in both I like both games uh, for different reasons and yeah I will I will continue to play them them both uh, I don't feel like it's choosing between this and that, you, you you can have both, it's it's your own individual choice. If you prefer one and not the other, well, that's cool. Um, as long as you enjoy the choices you make in your games, that's exactly what you're supposed to do. So, um, let's go back to, to this view for the time being, because if that is overpowering my voice, which eh, I'm hoping it's not, I'll give it a check afterwards, just before I record the, the next episode. Just to make sure. Um, but yeah, so. Yay! Look at that. Now we're getting we're getting dirt from a different angle. So there we go. So this is the bit that I got a little frustrated with when I was ploughing. Because I couldn't get that grass bits to go. And so I was just I felt like I should got have gotten those grass bits to go, but it it wasn't to be. 
so I've kind of gone with it. But um, seeing the way that the AI ploughs is completely different to the way that it taught me to plough in the tutorial. Which I think is an interesting touch. It, to not actually get the AI program to plough the way that you're going to tell people to plough in a tutorial seems a little bit counterintuitive. A um, little bit strange, but... Yeah. Yeah, so... Yeah, I'm just going to say, yeah. <laughs> That's about as, as, as non-committal as you can get, so... <laughs> So we're getting there. We're about halfway, so um, we've still got some undulations in the uh, in the field, but that's about natural. I'm not uh, I'm not going to lose any sleep over it. Um, we haven't named our farmer dude yet, um, so I'm kind of thinking again, names-wise. We had Farmer Giles in Agricultural Simulator Historical down in Tuscany. Um, so we probably need an Americanish type name for our, our guy here in USA West. So, um, yeah, suggestions in the comments, please. Um, I'll, uh, I'll probably either pick randomly or pick one that kind of really tickles my fancy. So if it's um, amusing or can be a, a little bit derpy, that's cool. Um, yeah, because I like amusement. We all, we could we could always do with more amusement in our lives. I feel. Uh, I uh, when I get to work, I start my day with um, uh, the non sequitur calendar, and uh, some of them are such hilariously good um, cartoons. Uh, I think it was the one that was. It was either today or yesterday. And I had a good chuckle at it because there's a guy with um, water skis on, with a piece of rope attached, and he's in his hot tub. <laughs> and the repairman's kind of, yeah, I think you might be running the jets a little bit too high for this. And I know probably it it, it loses something in translation, but seeing that image is, it just tickled me. So I just, I practically showed that round to the entire office just because I was so so amused by it and in the morning start off with a laugh it's the best way to start the day it really is um, so yeah and that is my tip for the day <laughs> of course being Saturday you should be laughing already so uh, yeah or at least yeah I hope so so yeah we can, hopefully when we get our worker dudes, they'll kind of, this um, section next to us where we've got those undulations, those might even out a little bit because they'll they'll go through and um, fix it all up for us, I think we've got two chances so yes, so this is um, an episode of cultivating um, cultivating and cultivation and all that lovely stuff that dirt's really caking up on the back of that, isn't it? Let's let's just get out and have a look. Yeah, you can see the dirt's really caking up on it. That's the realism is pretty good for that. So yeah, I'm, I'm yeah, I'm impressed. And like I said, the the textures and the quality seems to have have come up with with this. I'm finding it a lot crisper with the. Um, increased resolution so hopefully you guys are seeing that too and um, like I say if it's if the videos are too jerky then do do please let me know um, like I say I will be recording the next episode shortly after this one so I won't be able to correct it for that but I will I will make some changes if it's uh, turning out to be a problem for you guys uh, before the next record so do, 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 do. so I think we'll uh, head on up here another auto save and I think I will just finish the latter part of this field off screen 
because it's um, almost time for us to uh, call it a day again. And uh, yeah, so. Uh, Now's the part where I don't know which way to steer because it's I'm looking at it from the front. Oh, I'm figuring it out. Wow. That is so unlike me. <laughs> but I figured, yeah, why not? We don't normally look at it from the front, do we? So because it's it's incredibly well, it's not incredibly difficult, it's incredibly derpy to do. So, uh, there we go. So, I'm going to uh, leave it there for now. So, until next time, take care, folks.